According to dental experts, 178 million American adults are missing at least one tooth. That means constant implant work for dentists, a process that's much more an art than a science. But a state-of-the-art robot is changing all of that. Atlanta News first reporter Joshua Skinner went to LA, and, uh, LA or LaGrange to check out the assistant making dental implants safer, quicker, and less painful. Got it. Dr. Chuck Pitts has been a dentist for a long time. Started practice in 1983. Twist handpiece towards the chin. Dentistry has changed a lot in those 41 years. Dramatically, exponentially. For one thing, dentists now wear gloves. We just washed our hands a zillion times a day. But the work has always been there, much of it requiring more than just a filling. In our country alone, there are approximately 30 million people who have no teeth. That often requires dental implants. And when those implants are done by hand, there's at least a 10% fail rate. But advances in technology are lending a different kind of hand. It is a robotic device that allows us to be very efficient with our patient care when it comes to implants. It's called the Yomi Dental Robot. It's faster more efficient, and it's lowering your time in the chair. I'm within 1% of where I'm supposed to be every time. Down to fractions of a millimeter. Three. There are just 130 in the world, two in Georgia, but Pitts views it as the future of the industry. There are a number of dental schools in our country who have already made the commitment. It cuts down on mistakes, cuts down on visits, and for Pitts and Refresh Me Dental Center, comes at no extra cost to patients. Mesial palatal, locked in. Physically, what we do is very demanding. This makes my job easier. A robot that gives him less time with people and more time in the office. The possibility that this lets me continue to practice and continue to enjoy those relationships is really significant for me. In LaGrange, Joshua Skinner. Good job, Faith and Demarcus. Atlanta News First.